I just want to start off this video by saying that I'm only making this video because I'm tired of seeing people spending thousands of dollars on auto repair when they really don't need to. I'm tired of people going to auto shops and getting quoted for something where they overcharge them for parts and labor. I'm just sick of seeing that. So I'm only making this video because I have nothing to sell you guys. I'm not trying to promote anything. I'm just here to drop some helpful information. So if this, any of this helps you and benefits your life, just let me know in the comments down below. But in this video, I'm just going to be talking to you guys about if you want to save thousands of dollars in auto repair, this is why you need a mobile mechanic. So, my dad has a 2006 Civic sedan, and the AC went out on that Civic. So we took it into the shop, it just needed a new air compressor, and it just needed like a refrigerant recharge. Uh, so the shop pretty much quoted him about $400 for the labor, and they charged him about $320 for the air compressor, which is absolutely insane. Like, it's a simple job when the Civic doesn't really require, like, a lot of work or a lot of labor, like, at all. They can just get it done in, like, an hour. And then when we looked up the parts, uh, the AC compressor for the Civic was only $140 from AutoZone. But the shop said that it cost them $320. Plus that, with a $400 labor charge, which is absolutely just insane for just an AC compressor, like an old, like, an old, like, 06 Civic. So when he told me that, I was pretty shocked that it was like that expensive because I recently bought a beater car that I'll be making a video on shortly. I bought a 1997 SN95 V6 Mustang. So clean title, clean car, nothing really wrong with it. All I needed was a new like AC compressor, but I didn't want to take it to the shop because, you know, for the Mustang, the compressor was like a little bit more expensive at the shop. So it would have been maybe like $100, $200 more than my dad's 06 Civic. So I went on Marketplace and I found myself a mobile mechanic. Uh, we went through his description, he had about 40 reviews. He said that he's been in the mechanic for like the last like 20 years, he had shop experience. He was a, like ASC certified, like had all these like credentials. And I'm just like, you know what? I'll just send him a message. So I sent him a message about how much he charged for labor on my 1997 Mustang. And he said for pretty much without the part, he'd only charge 150 bucks for labor. $150 for labor compared to $400 at a regular shop. So for me, that was a steal. So he came over and then he said, okay, do you have the AC, do you have like uh, the AC compressor that you're working to put in this car? And I'm like, oh no, because I, like, I assumed, like I don't know why I assumed that he'd have the compressor or just get it ready for me. But I'm like, no, I don't have the AC compressor. Oh, and he's like, no problem. We can just like hop in my car. We drove down to the auto zone. We went back to the commercial station. So the my AC compressor for the 97 Mustang was about uh, roughly about $200, but with this mobile mechanics discount, I just paid out of my, he didn't pay for the part, I paid for the part. I only paid $175 for the AC compressor. We came back home and no, we also paid for the, re the refrigerant, but even got the refrigerant at a discount because of his uh, commercial discount license or whatever it's called. It's like a mobile mechanic thing they have with like AutoZone. So we came back to my house and after we had all the parts, he literally knocked out the job and like, half an hour you're kind of like oh well it was like 150 dollars for like 30 minutes which you know does sound ridiculous but when we compare it to like shops he just like knocked out like right in front of me he even showed me how to do it for just in case like next time like i want to do it myself so i paid about 175 dollars for the ac compressor plus an extra 20 dollars for the refrigerant that we got at a discount and then he knocked down in half like super quick i didn't have to wait a couple hours and have to wait like a few days to get it done there was no hold up and then we just like, while he was working on it, we're just like cracking jokes, having a good time. I got him like an ice water. And then he's just like telling me like his whole story of being a mechanic. And he just, he knocked it out in like 30 minutes right there. I hopped in my car, turned on the AC, it blew ice cold right there. He made sure that it worked. It's also another pricing story. So this one pretty much happened today. Um, my dad's 06 Civic is leaking a lot of power steering fluid. I looked underneath it, the lines are fine. It's not leaking from any of the lines, but it is leaking from the rack and pinion. So we looked up estimates for local shops around our area, like shops we used to like always go to, and they pretty much quoted us for a thousand dollars plus like with parts and labor included, thousand dollars. So that's for an 06 Civic. I mean, the 06 Civic is probably worth it, like around a thousand bucks. It's a salvage title with like four hundred thousand miles on it, but you know we, we've had it since like 06. It's like been the family for way too long. We can't get rid of it. Uh, so when they said a thousand dollars, I pretty much like hit up my mobile mechanic who just fixed my uh, Mustang a couple days ago. And he was like, okay, so how much would you charge, like, labor-wise for the rack and pinion? And he said, oh, we can get you uh, for labor. I'll get you at $400 for the full fix. 
and it'll probably be he pretty much like sent me like the link where he's getting the part from he's like oh, it'll be like 120 bucks for the right opinion with his like mobile mechanics discount so compare that 520 bucks compared to a thousand i'm literally like saving half the money i would have spent on a shop for the rack and pinion for the 06 Civic, including parts and labor. Like a thousand dollars at a shop for rack and pinion, or this trusted mobile mechanic with years of history who was saying he can do it for 400 bucks plus 120 bucks and pretty much the only part that he needs. It's it's literally a no brainer. Like if you want to spend a thousand dollars to go to a shop you like, you're cool with, you got connections there, you can get a better price than that, then yeah, sure, go for it. But for the guy that, you know, doesn't really go to the shop that often and you're hit with a huge fix or a huge amount to pretty much like fix the problem, get a mobile mechanic. Get a trusted mobile mechanic with the experience and they can pretty much do it for half the price that these shops are doing it with the same quality and faster. You won't wait hours to get the job done. Well, depending on the job. You won't have to wait days or weeks for them to start working your car because they're so backed up which is like other people's cars. They'll do it right in front of you, right at your house, take it to their house, they can do it there, any way you want to do it. If you want to save half the money you'd spend at a shop, get a mobile mechanic, man. Just go to Marketplace, go on Google. It's a no brainer. Like if you like burning money, go to a shop. But if you want to build a connection, build a relationship for a guy, you can just call up at any time, be like, hey, I'm broken down over here. Hey, uh, I got a guy who needs this for his car. Like, what's the quote? Do like, like get the relationship you build with the mobile mechanic is crucial. It's crucial. Here's the whole moral of the story is that shops work at a certain labor rate. They charge way more because, you know, they have to pay for lights, they have to pay for rent. They have to pretty much, you know, pay for the employees. So they have all these overhead costs that need to cover. That's why they charge more. So I have nothing against shops. I have nothing against people that work in shops. But for the guys that really don't have a lot of money to spend on like, you know, thousands of dollars in auto repair, I highly advise you to look into a mobile mechanic. You can find them on Google. You can find them on Facebook Marketplace. You can see all the reviews or description. They put all their experience like on there. So if you want super cheap auto work, and it's not, it's not just cheap, it's cheap, it's fast, and it's quality. When you get it from the right guy. And yeah, don't just get some like random mobile mechanic like that says like oh i've been working on cars you know for the last like couple of weeks like i can do like a brake change here that like a guy with not that much experience like don't hire that guy there are plenty of certified techs that are still working in a dealership or they started their own mobile mechanic business and their rates are super cheap but yeah once again i have nothing to sell you guys i just want to save you guys the most amount of money possible because i just don't want you guys overpaying like thousands of dollars in auto repair when you really don't need to so just leave a comment below if you agree with me, if you disagree with me, or if you're like, oh, you would save a lot more if you just did the work yourself. I totally agree, but not all people have, you know, the knowledge of the resources or the time to do it, which I think those are all the excuses. They just, most of the time we're just lazy, that's it. But yeah, hopefully this helped you guys and hopefully you guys can make a more well-informed decision when it comes to spending money in your car, when it comes to spending on your repairs. So if you like this type of info or you like these type of videos, give me a sub. Catch you guys later.